2 minus 6 gives us negative 4. So most people say negative 4 times. Inside this parentheses, we have 2 minus 6, which is also negative 4. So negative 4 times negative 4 equals positive 16. But that answer is not correct. Because according to the order of operations, first we do parentheses, then exponents, then multiplication or division, and finally addition or subtraction. And remember, multiplication and division have equal priority, and we must always move from left to right. The same rule applies to addition and subtraction. In this expression we have one subtraction, one multiplication, and one parentheses. Inside the parentheses, we have one subtraction. And we have a multiplication because whenever a number touches a parentheses, it automatically means multiplication, even if the multiplication sign isn't shown. So according to PEMDAS, first we must evaluate the parenthesis, then the multiplication, and only then the subtraction. If we subtract before multiplying, or before solving the parentheses, the whole answer becomes wrong. So first, the parenthesis. Inside the parentheses, 2 minus 6 equals negative 4. So now the expression becomes 2 minus 6 times negative 4. Now we have one subtraction and one multiplication. According to PEMDAS, multiplication comes before subtraction, so we must multiply first. So negative 6 times negative 4 gives us positive 24. Now we have 2 plus 24, which equals 26. And this is our final answer. The correct answer is 26. Beautiful ending challenge. Before you go, try this one. Same style, just different numbers. 4 minus 6 times 4 minus 6. Take your time, think it through, and drop your answer in the comments. I'll be checking. Subscribe, like, and share. Thank you so much for watching. Keep learning.